We are in the book of Romans, and this is so exciting to understand faith righteousness, what God has done for us by making us right with God. And so in Romans 3, we saw that we can be justified freely by grace. So grace was introduced in Romans 3, and then Romans 4 spoke about how faith now takes a hold of that grace, and we need to be fully persuaded by giving glory to God. And here in Romans 5, it gives us the way to live with a combination of these two forces, faith that grabs a hold of grace. So grace and faith is right here. And Romans 5 verse 1 and 2 says, Therefore, having been justified by faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ, through whom also we have access by faith into this grace in which we stand and rejoice in the hope of the glory of God. The first thing we need to know is that by faith we have peace with God. Are you experiencing peace with God today? Or are you feeling unworthy because of what you have done or what you should have done? I want to tell you by faith you can just take your peace with God and say, Hey, I'm right with God because of Jesus. But then we need access to that grace in our everyday life. And it says that we stand in grace, but we still need access. So you can stand in the rain but there can be an umbrella of judgment over you. So you are standing in the rain, but the umbrella is stopping that rain from touching you. And so you need to close that umbrella of judgment and access the grace of God. Start dancing in the grace of God. Dance in the rain. Let the grace of God wash over you so that you can experience it. And when we do that, when we embrace the grace of God, we will start reigning in life over sin and death. And so Romans 5.17 says, For if by one man's offense death reigned through the one, much more those who receive abundance of grace and of the gift of righteousness will reign in life through the one Jesus Christ. It says here, much more those who receive, receive, receive. We need to learn how to receive that much more grace. And the more sin has become in this world, the more grace is available. Your sin will never be able to outweigh God's grace. God's grace is more than enough for you and it will be uh, available for the rest of your life and you can just receive and receive and drink from that grace. Close the umbrella of judgment and see how your life changes with that relationship with God, free from judgment, free from guilt and start accessing that grace that is available through faith in what Jesus has done. Don't rely on your own works. Don't rely on your own goodness. Rely on the grace of God and dance in His goodness. Dance in His reign. Always remember, you are highly favored and deeply loved.